Types of Chemical Reactions Most reactions can be classified as one of the following. Precipitation, that's when you form an insoluble product out of aqueous solutions. Basically, you mix two liquids together and a solid comes out of it. The solid is insoluble and you call it precipitation. Second one is oxidation reduction. That's the exchange of electrons between atoms and ions. And you can see from the picture there, a lot of energy can be, can be released in oxidation reduction reactions. And then acid base, that's when you mix an acid together with a base and a salt and water comes out of it. And we'll provide more details on all three of these. We'll focus first on precipitation reactions. Here's an example. This is a giant clam here. See the blue and the gray and all that stuff. That clamshell is made from the precipitation of calcium carbonate. Precipitation reactions involve the reaction of water-soluble ionic compounds. That means they dissolve in water, okay? And when they react, they form a water-insoluble product called a precipitate. So here's an example. Over here, we have an aqueous solution, silver nitrate. Here we have hydrochloric acid. Uh, if it were not in solution like this, it would just be called hydrogen chloride but it is an aqueous solution, so it's hydrochloric acid. You can see they are both liquids. When you mix them together, what happens is you see this white cloud here. That's a solid. That is silver chloride coming out of solution, and it's a solid. We call that the silver chloride precipitate. And the liquid that is left behind is nitric acid. And here you can see it's a liquid because of the aqueous. Precipitation reactions. Some ionic compounds are water soluble and some are not. The insoluble compounds form a precipitate. That's key. Some general rules, rules apply. This is a lot to memorize, but I guess the more you work with it, the more comfortable you'll be with knowing it. Always soluble. Okay, that will start there. Ammonium, acetate, chlorate, nitrate and group 1A metal ion. So at least you can remember that and try and remember these four guys here. Sometimes soluble, okay? Sometimes they are, sometimes they're not. Chlorine, bromine, iodine, except when combined with silver, mercury, and lead. And notice these are all ions. Sulfate, except when combined with silver, mercury, lead, calcium, strontium, barium, and again, they are all ions insoluble unless they're paired with a soluble ion life is not simple is it carbonate phosphate hydroxide sulfur fluorine oxygen so this bears some review 